And we're off. And Orville, much like Miguel Curbio, Orville enjoys driving. He's in, he's smiling about it. So this is good. This may, maybe apparently Orville is not say superstitious. <laughs> He isn't bothered about taking over the vehicle after what happened to Miguel. <laughs> as like like many people would be. Hopefully you don't spend quite as much time driving around on the surface of the moon this time. I really hope not, because honestly that previous time it got it got it got kind of mind numbing. <laughs> Well, somebody else I had they had a, a good suggestion that I should have put the long range muon detector on on the little moon buggy here uh, simply because that one has the the light it'll tell you whether you're getting closer to or further away from uh, a muon emitting artifact okay, looks like coming up in kind of a downhill might want to start slowing it down a little bit. Not having a repeat of the previous the previous tumbling incident. It's really difficult to tell. It's difficult to gauge the the time, the length of these beeps. I, I keep on thinking that it sounds like it's just a little bit faster, but it's hard to tell. One thing I noticed that in the uh, in the version 17. I suppose I should call it point one seven, you know, seventeen. Um, that the the problem that sixteen introduced, where with the powered hinges from the from the robotics uh, mod, uh, that that problem apparently has been fixed. So I can go back and I can rebuild the original prospectors. It's it's wider stance landing gear, so it won't be quite so unstable on some of these slopes so I'm, that's very very good that makes me happy does that sound to you like it's beeping faster i think it's beeping faster that's what i think then i'm sometimes wrong about these things back again okay we're not quite into the middle between them yeah let's aim for this point right over there I know, I'm, I'm almost of the opinion, I think, either either the, the beeping is getting no change, or it's actually might be getting slower. It's so hard to tell. Okay, here's a nice flat spot here in order to park the buggy for a second. Park buggy, park. Wanting to spin around. Okay, here's your parking brake. Let's put the landing gear out. Let's kill the beeper. And Orville's gonna get out and he's going to take a, a visual, more visual survey of the area. Extend mobility enhancer. <laughs> Kerbals look so funny when they try to walk. <laughs> Does that that just look so badass, the the planet and the horizon. I love it. Alright, so we're going to learn the lessons from from the from the late great Kirby Miguel Kirby. And we're going to be very, very respectful of this steep slope over here. I don't want to lose Orville the same way. Yeah, but I can't, but I need to be able to see down there. Uh, let's try it this way. Here, let's turn his pack on. I'm just going to go fly out over the top. At this crater. We're going to take a look. Let's 
It's so dark, I might be able to, even if it is down here, I'd be, I'd miss seeing it, you know what I'm saying? Much fuel in the pack, see he's already used up 12% of his pack. I'm not certain he has enough fuel to, say, fly down to the bottom. And look. All right, okay. Go back to the prospector, dude. Whoops. <laughs> okay, it's kind of an inelegant landing. <laughs> Get up. It's okay, though. It's okay. Though. Took it like a champ. Turn that pack off. I'm going to test this hypothesis. I got to think, I think that... Yeah, uh, if going back into the into the moon buggy, I think that that refills his pack. I believe it does. Okay, here, jump up, grab that thing. Ah, okay, so he's getting better with practice. He did it the first time. That there we go. And let's just get right back out there and see. Did that? Did that refill your pack? And. Can't see. Okay, well, here, let's get it off of there so I can see it. Yes, yes, it did refill his pack. Awesome. Okay, okay, here we go. Whoops, orbital. Damn it. Why is he not standing up? Um, wait a second, what happened here? Why well, I'm pushing buttons and he's not getting up? Orville. Orville! Guys, I'm... I'm worried. Orville! Did you just knock yourself out or something? Um, Orville, stand... Okay, can I turn the pack on? Can you move... What? Okay, good. Yes. Good. Good. I think he got, like, stuck under there. That was almost... That was almost, like, the worst mission failure ever. Oh my god, that would have been horrible. Yeah, he, like, got stuck underneath that fuel tank he couldn't stand up and he's trying to move wow Orville that was a that was close man what if he got wedged under there and that that would I mean he wouldn't how long would he last you know that would have been horrible okay okay turn the lights on again take a look at what we got over here What I need is a very, um, a very short range muon detector. You know, like a, so a pocket size version so we can take it out here. There's a cruiser in here. All right. Okay, I do not see anything worth seeing over here. Uh, do I got enough juice to move over there? Uh, I bet you that's farther in away than it actually looks. Okay, return. Here we go. I just strongly suspect, I mean, if I were if I were going to put an artifact around here, I would put it in one of these craters. That's what I would do. Cause I'm, I'm thinking if it were around in one of these other hills, I would have seen it by now, you know? And back, thrust backwards a little bit. Oh, I guess I, I can get closer still. I already know where the arches are. I don't need to look for those. All right, thrust backwards and dang, another <laughs> another bad landing. <laughs> Whoops.
Whoops. <laughs> Sorry about that, Orville. Orville is not complaining about it, though. Okay, okay. Well, let's get back into the moon buggy and consider where Orville's going to go next. See if you can avoid getting stuck under one of these fuel tanks. That was a hazard. I was unaware of that hazard previously. And board. Okay. Okay. So we've got a collection of creators over here. So this this is yeah, that that's where that's where that's where Mr. Kerbio. That's where we lost Kerbio. Um Yeah. Why is my moon buggy not showing up here? Yeah, okay, so we lost Kerbio in that one. We've taken a look down in here. Um took a look over here. I think next I'm going to cruise on over this direction and see what that looks like. I wonder if I can see anything from there. Cheat cheating the third person cam. I'm just not finding it yet. <laughs> 